guys in this shot i'm currently showing i was chilling in helen's bay it's a beach i'll include a few pictures and reviews or what whatever here it was a pretty sunny day it was probably the warmest day belfast has had this year uh i don't remember for sure but i'm pretty sure it exceeded 20 degrees celsius that day maybe even 25 degrees celsius i think it was 26 to 27 i'm not sure anyways it was pretty hard to film over there since there was crazy amount of wind as you can see the seagulls were even suffering while flying because the wind was crazy i believe it was probably because it was near the seashore and crazy amounts of wind was coming from the sea through the waves as well so I really had to like stabilize my camera a lot, but I managed to film enough videos to include them in this video. I decided to also include this little black bird. I don't know the name of it, but my dad said it was a rare sighting, so I included it. Later on while editing, I actually realized I didn't film enough videos for this whole vlog. So what you're going to be seeing in this whole vlog for probably six minutes is just small snippets and clip -its. I was wearing glasses the whole trip, so I realized how different the C actually looked when I took my glasses off so I tried to put in my perspective through the camera lens even though it didn't show up completely similar to what I witnessed I guess it was similar enough also there was a plane flying by and there was a big <laughs> that was startling Anyways, we went to this place. I have no idea what this place is called. I literally, I don't know how to look up the location on Google Maps either for this place. If I did, I would insert it on text, but I guess just fly that through. There were a ton of seashells on it, on the floor. Teeny amounts of seashells. I picked a few up, but editing this, I realized there were red mites on them as well and red spiders, which is probably not the best, but the ones I picked up, I washed them immediately after. So I guess I chose a safe bet. Anyways, this is the night. This is me after coming home and this is like 11 p.m. or something. Um, we decided to go to Tim Hortons. Also, this person parked really poorly. It was a really tight space. So we suffered trying to get out of there. Just decided to include that. We decided to get a few desserts from Tim Hortons and I'll be showing you soon enough what desserts I chose to get specifically. The atmosphere was pretty nice and the parking space was pretty empty as well. Tim Hortons, here are the reviews and the stars. Me personally, I'll be inputting a review. I expected a lot from Timbits, but they only... There, there was no diversity in the Timbits. I'm going to be roasting Timbits right now. Tim Hortons, what are you doing? You didn't put enough diversity in the Timbits. You only gave me one chocolate one. Two out of ten. They were really oily. <laughs> the next day, uh, we decided to go to Victoria Square, in which I poorly filmed everything as well. <laughs> But before going to Victoria Square, we went to Forest Side Center um, to return a few items from H&M since I guess they were poor quality. This is me showing the journey to Forest Side. I guess I really should film more. I swear guys, I will try my best in the next video I, I, I upload. <laughs> But I'm always left on red. Ooh, no. And every time we Yay, we enter H&M and immediately I film getting out. Anyways, I really wanted to play this to get Shrek, but I knew I'd fail, so I just didn't have hope. 
initially. And now this is our trip to Victoria Square. I saw this really cute puppy, which I wanted to film. Also, the architecture in Belfast is somewhat fascinating. Not even somewhat, it's pretty fascinating when you get in the main city. It's really entertaining to look at. We had a parking space, so it took us about 10 minutes to walk to Victoria Square. Um, I really didn't film Victoria Square enough. Well, to summarize my journey in Victoria Square, I went to H&M, New Look, and Urban Outfitters. However, I didn't really get anything since we mainly went there to return another few items. So that's about it. I hope you guys enjoy this vlog, even though it was pretty, a pretty rough vlog. And thank you for watching.